very fucking funny. Hmm. The police says differently that Autumn Ross, everybody else, you're getting involved, keeps coming at me. No wonder why the police are not helping you because they understand enough is enough. So I think it's pretty fucking bad that the police are letting me go a little on the loose cannon right now because people like you deserve it. And they know that Autumn Largent and Autumn Ross, everybody keeps coming at me. But it's double standards, hypocrites, that these people think it's okay to attack people. But other people are supposed to keep their mouth shut. I think it's right down comical that the police are going to be looking at your shit thinking like ever since... This bitch has got a warrant out for her arrest. She's been nothing but harassing me because she's being hiding out. Half the people are hiding her out. And half these people are pissed at me because I'm standing my ground. I don't much give a fuck. I'm pretty sure people are laughing. I don't give a fuck. This just states that I can keep mm -hmm. proof that people are not leaving me alone. So how can I put into a sale asylum mm -hmm. when you fuckers are out here doing way worse than me? I'm just having proof. And police told me I can keep proof of threat, slander, and whoever's threatening me. I can keep proof on my YouTube. And also slandering like Autumn Ross is doing. These people. Are an accomplices. To the bullshit. Of Abigail. Autumn Ross. Autumn Largent. You are an accomplice. And the cops know I don't need help. And uh, the officer. Is getting pretty fucking fed up. Of you guys not leaving me alone. But just like I said, the consequences that people and the cops know, people have done too much to me. And I got a messed up feeling that I don't know what's going on. But if you people are getting pissed off because I'm stating truth and facts that you're starting shit with me non-stop still. And you're getting pissed off because an officer's not called you back. It's because he knows you guys are an accomplice. Anybody on your fucking Facebook who comments, who gets in the middle of it, is a fucking accomplice. Oh, this stupid bitch is friends with my father. Stupid fucking cunt. I think it's comical you're coming at me knowing you're friends with my fucking dad, you stupid fucking cunt. Oh, but I guess it don't matter, right? It's just so damn comical how you're an accomplice. Autumn Ross, Autumn Larchant's accomplice. Abigail's accomplice. Felicia Bass is an accomplice. From all these insults, because the police already know what people mm -hmm. are doing to me. Well, if people are over it and stop threatening me, and people will get charged. So, like I said, Autumn Largent, Autumn Ross, they know you drugged me in my sleep. They know you're the one you got fucking arrested with a needle and a syringe. So, you're the one... That's causing issues with Abigail and you're an accomplice. So I'm sorry that you feel like this. But you got to understand the police knows I've had enough is enough. 
And they probably see through your guys' bullshit. It's nothing but drama that it is double standards in a cop's eyes. Because they're stating, well, you guys have been doing shit to me. So why can I not do it back? So pretty much you're, what you're doing, basically what the police told me is that these people are harassing me first. It's harassing me. And, uh, and also falsely accuse me knowing that this fucking whore of a son of a bitch that don't know how to be a proper mom talked about my dead mother. Actually, two people, this stupid fucking cunt of a whore of Jay Aldridge's is a meth head and got charged with drugs knowing that she drugged me and Cody in our damn sleep. So I suggest you better watch yourself because you got multiple charges on you, bitch. You did drug me in my sleep. And I think it's hilarious that the cops told me that Abigail, Autumn Ross, Autumn Largent, whoever they get involved is harassment and they are slandering me. So, just like I said, the police already knows I'm being harassed. I'm being slandered, too. And, uh, I think it's right down comical that people want to talk foo foo gazy for cuckoo puffs because everybody took advantage of it. I was in Facebook jail for three days straight. And people are still coming at me because I'm speaking truth and I'm speaking facts. I'm, I must be a fucking target that you guys must love. If I'm a target, there's an issue with you. No, that means you got an obsession with me. Nice try, reverse psychology bullshit ain't gonna work on me. So I just think it's right down comical that the police knows if people would just knock off their shit and stop their bullshit, the cops already know I'm not the issue. The cop already stated it. Other people just need to leave it alone. It needs to stop their drama bullshit. So I just think it's kind of funny that these people want to talk their mad shit knowing that a cop, all of them have stated that their drama, Autumn Ross, Abigail, Felicia Baz, whoever you guys are getting involved are accomplices. The police already knows. No, the Hell's Angels won't come after me. They'll come after you for drugging an innocent person in their fucking sleep, bitch. I think it's fucking comical as hell. Dude, you don't even know what the hell the comment even is, so... I just think it's right down comical that you're talking shit about Grandpa Storm. Yeah, I am throwing names out because I know who the fuck is involved. It's you, Autumn Largent, Jay Aldridge, Felicia Baz, Lil Jimmy, Kelsey. Was in a fucking group and you guys have been talking about it. So why are you bringing Abigail involved? Why are you bringing her in the middle of it? Of the rape towards me with Jay Aldridge trying to give me HIV. Why are you bringing Abigail in the middle of it, huh? Huh? Oh, I bet you're not telling her that. Oh, I forgot. You don't like to say what the fuck you're saying. The Hell's Angels won't come after me, honey. I promise you that. Because I'm an innocent and you drugged me in my sleep. You know what that means? Drugged me in my sleep? Is saying that I didn't freely want it in my blood system. Somehow you did it. No, honey. The Hell's Angels are going to be coming after your stupid ass. Because you hurt an innocent. They don't like that. If you don't stop your meth, they'll make you stop. And I will throw names out there. Because the cops already know. So I think it's pretty right down comical. That, uh... I just think it's right down comical that these imbeciles just can't stop. And the cop told me, 
show proof. If people are not leaving me alone, this is a paper trail and everybody is fucked. All these people are fucked and screwed. All these names, all these people, all these people's profiles, you're fucked pretty much. And because saying I'm, I'm nuts is because I'm speaking truth and I know my facts. So I think it's right down comical that you're getting people involved and falsely accusing me knowing Autumn Ross, Autumn Largent, you're the one that had drugs on you that night. So I think it's right down comical. You're an accomplice. She's an accomplice. Abigail's accomplice. Felicia's an accomplice. Because I'm sticking up for myself and you want to sit there and bash people. The police officer ain't gonna really much care right now because he wants the bullshit to stop. The state, the county, the city, all of these cops want this bullshit to stop. They want it to stop. And you guys are an accomplices by keep false information in on me, which pretty much already know the truth. And for one, Autumn Ross, if you, if you think you're so fucking smart, they already know what I said to the police. They must know something's true that you're involved in. So pretty much cops don't get involved for no fucking reason. So just like I said, all these people, pretty much karma has bit you in your fucking ass. You have attacked people for way too long. Then now you got somebody who is standing their ground one on one. I don't have people commenting and sticking up for me. You're fucking coward ass, pussy ass little bitches. All you do want to gang up on me, guess what? You're not much an alpha female bitch. If you all got to gang up on me like this, you're not an alpha bitch. You're just a fake ass wannabe, tough wannabe bitch. I'm the one standing my ground. And I really don't have much people helping me. For except Cody one time commenting... Saying, guys, you need to leave us alone. That's it. But other than that, I'm standing myself, my ground, and I'm not being a pussy-ass little bitch gonna have your puppet on the strings, bitches doing your dirty work for ya. So, pretty much, the cop is gonna know this. I don't give a fuck. Because it's right down comical that you want a cop's help knowing what you have caused. The police know what you have caused, Abigail, and so does they know about Autumn Ross and Autumn Largent and Felicia Baz, Little Jimmy and Kelsey Romney, whatever the fuck her name is. They know what you guys have pulled upon me. So, like I said, you all are ganging up in a group, and I'm here standing one person. That says a lot. I got enough fucking courage to stand on my own, but you got to have other bitches your puppet on a strings to do your dirty work? Really, bitches? Are you really that much of a coward that you guys can't stand on your own for real? This is fucking hilarious that I'm standing on my own. I'm one person and there's like multiple, multiple ganging up on me on your side. That says much you guys are much cowards and that you see me as a threat and you see me as a fucking target, which is fucking comical as fuck. But just like I said, it pisses you off. Well, you pissed off the law too. Everybody is pissed off the law. Abigail and Autumn Ross, Autumn Largent, apparently you pissed off the law themselves too. Because they know you're slandering me and you're harassing me. So you can't so you can't do double standards with the police right now. I'm sorry. It ain't gonna work. It ain't gonna fly. Because they know you're being double standards, you're being two faced, and you're being a fucking hypocrite. They already know it. So I think it's right down comical how there's people wanna be in a group to act froggy but can't really back it up. When it comes to me snapping or to me standing my ground. Like I said, I'm standing on my fucking own. Like I said again, I'm standing one person and you got other bitches and you're puppet on the strings of attacking me. Which I think is right down comical as fuck. 
that none of you are able to stand on your own. You are not capable of it. So you think you're stronger in a group. Well, guess how I think. I'm stronger on my own. Fucking comical. But just like I said, the police are going to see this. I do not give a fuck. I want it to stop. They want it to stop. And apparently, Abigail and Autumn Ross, apparently you don't want it to stop enough because you keep coming at me. So they're looking at it in a perspective that you guys are still coming at me. And I told them I'm protecting myself. I'm standing my ground. So pretty much they're all going to question you about what the fuck's going on. Not me. They say you guys as the problem. Because it looks like you brought in a Marisha Wallace. Huh. Kind of funny. You're friends with my father, bitch. And I hope he says something to you. I hope he snaps on you, bitch. Huh. That's funny as fuck. But just like I said, everybody's an accomplice. Whoever you're getting involved, whoever picture I got, whoever profile I got, whoever I expose, they are an accomplices. Have a nice day. Should have thought about that before you start coming at me first. Hmm. Bad day for you. Have a nice day.